And we are starting. So we're going to start off with Raze Rob versus Flappy in this Kickstart League match. Well, they're, they're picking their characters Slappy. right now. Uh, I got to catch the last of the the last match of the last one, and Slappy seems to be doing the same thing he always does. Which is, uh, Mixing in people to no end. Oh yeah. yeah. Yeah, he's got some really good left-right mix-ups. Ooh, Rob with the really good mash, though. Um, oh. That oh. can be very risky as well, because Slappy does have... Wow, again. Uh, Slappy does have the DP assist that he can call to cover it, but if you either mash correctly, that crouching medium kick might just be active enough to hit the assist on the way in, honestly. Um, uh, yeah, I, I would think so. I mean, it's, it's pretty big and pretty active, so... Also, that was a really, really good sweep to go under the, uh, the double pain wheel jump heavy punch. Yeah. This is gonna- yeah, probably gonna swap just for the health. So because Rob is a solo, he has two reasons to want to swap- uh, to snap back here. One, you know, he gets double back out with notably less red health. Two, he also gets a bunch of his health back. Yeah, the the red health, it's kind of like the whole reason you play a solo, honestly. Like, I feel like if you didn't get red health back, you would be... I mean, other than, you know, the massive Crazy damage. damage. But... Ooh, I think this is going to be it. Yeah, yep, that's going to be the kill. Yeah. Um, also, just as a heads up, I may be slightly behind. I'm having some weird, like connection delay issues. Luckily, it is definitely on my end and not the side of the actual gameplay. Okay. Yeah, there was no... I I'm, haven't had any spikes or anything like that, so... Okay. Uh, yeah, I'm really not sure why it's happening, but... One of those things that happen, so, I guess. At least there's rollback. Yep. Savior of everything. Time to put on a show. Showtime. There we go. Uh, now the scoreboard. <laughs> <laughs> um, the last game Rob did pretty well. Uh, yeah. I haven't played against him in a while, but he has gotten really a lot better since last time. Whole lot since I fought him. Yeah. There's that cross. But, uh, but yeah. It's such a... I, I don't know. I... Double... Double... Frustrates me to play against. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's reasonable. <laughs> it's like every... It feels like all the other characters I like... You know... That I, I res Like, their resets I can at least sometimes get and catch, but whenever I'm playing against Slappy, I just always seem to get hit by the mix-ups, because by the time I catch on to his left-right, he starts throwing grabs. And, man, Slappy definitely, he got one opening, he just totally ran away with that whole match. Yeah, uh, his, his, um, his combo game is on point. I don't think, it, I rarely He's see him He's definitely one of the strongest in the league so far. Yeah. So usually when I see, when I see him get that last reset, and I just glance up at the health bar, I'm like, ah, oh, yeah. Yep. Whole lot of dead characters. All right, so with that, Raze Rob is now eliminated from this crew battle. Uh, obviously, he'll be back in future. But for the rest of the match, he's no longer in any form. Flappy, on the other hand, uh, assuming this does not end up as a sweep or something, Flappy will probably have the chance to come through and play again, especially as he does continue until everyone on one team or the other has been eliminated. And Slappy's complaining over in the Discord that no one's ever going to get hit by the same side pistol because no one ever swaps to blocking the cross-up. <laughs> That's a good problem to have, right? Yeah. You know, when no one blocks your reset, it's pretty good. Uh, I have never seen Mick Herpy Derp's uh, play. 
so I really don't know what I'm uh, about to see. Uh, I saw in the last one, he definitely had, like, explosive moments, but he did get eliminated in the first match. I'm not sure if was against him, though. Uh, oh no, this- sorry, for a second I thought this was double Bayo ban. Uh, he doesn't need- he doesn't need the Bayo, we'll just the jump. <laughs> yeah, there I mean... Like, Big Band, he already does crazy damage without, uh, being a solo, but now... Yeah, and man, uh, the Kirby Derps, or sorry, yeah, the Kirby Derps is getting a lot of mileage out of just that, uh, what is it, like, medium or heavy punch? A-Train? The armored dash punch. Hammerfall, basically. Uh, yeah, like, uh, uh that's, yeah, right the Brass Knuckle. Brass Knuckle, okay, yeah. Yeah. Was that a parry attack? That, that kind of looked like... There was the sound of a parry in there, for sure. Man, that... If he would have parried that, I don't care if he lost. That would have been, <laughs> that been a win in my book. Yeah, for sure. And man, so McCurpy Derps looked real good for the first half of that. He was just... Basically, he just correctly called out like five neutral interactions in a row with that, uh, the dash punch. Uh, Brass Knuckle, you said? Yeah, and so. just got the kill on Beowulf off of like just raw neutral. Unfortunately, yeah. that did not hold up once the other big band was in, and it seemed like it kind of got super death. Yeah, I, I mean, when you have big band with meter and big band on a solo, because I, from what I understand, big band doesn't really build meter too much on his own. So, All right. like, typically, I'd be much more scared of a big band that just. Comes uh, in with three or four meter. Hang on. Oh. Lobby just crashed. Full. Oh. Uh. Huh. It is a Tuesday. Theme. Oh uh, yeah. All right. Let's get everyone back in the lobby. I uh, posted the link oh. in the Discord chat. Oh, okay. Is we're going to a new one. Goal Girls Lobbies, Tuesdays on Steam. What a day to run three matches, right? <laughs> yeah. Okay, just... so we are... What's up? Huh? What were you gonna say? I didn't mean to cut you off. Uh... Oh. I mean, I don't know. I, I had something in there about Steam and Tuesdays, but... <laughs> that was, it was kind of like half-hearted. Anyway. All right. Uh, is the match going right now? Because uh, no, they're on character select. Yeah, there we go. Now it's starting up. Oh, okay. Oh, uh, I'm not spectating this. So. Ah, oh. Okay. Uh, well, I guess I'm back on commentary for a second then. All right. So we have got King DDD versus Bayo Band, and Mercurius is off to a pretty strong start here again. The Brass Knuckles hasn't worked that time. One block, one swap, though the block did not get punished. It looks like McCurpy Derps is willing to just play a lot more patiently right now. Tried to call out a jump, not quite. Oh, okay, that was a neat pickup off that assist. I feel like the really high screen pickups are always real neat. Oh, yeah. It's like it caught him jumping, but this damage. So little big band seems like a character that would just do easy damage. Yeah, for sure. His uh, uh, I mean, it's just the the whole his uh, assists. You know, like uh, I think no one really finds no one really plays solos, but big band in particular, he's just big bodied and kind of likes being in control to begin with. So. Ooh, yeah. If you'd done any other of the armored things right there, besides the anti-air grab, it would have worked. But Zerky stayed grounded. I expect McCurpy Derps to be kind of fishing for a snap here. He has a lot of red health. 
Uh, Zerky is more than willing to just play real patiently at the moment, though. See if he can make the Kirby Derps crack first. And straight into Super? Okay. Just going for the... Oh, he didn't get the pickup off of it. But this could... Oh, okay. Drops the combo. Still, though, solo damage here. Life totals are pretty close to even. Uh, some unfortunate drops on that combo there. But... And that's going to be... Yeah. All right. All right. So McCurpy Derps does go down. That was a very close match, though. Um, if he'd gotten, like, one pickup off of the launcher there of those last two that hit or hadn't gotten the blocked, that was easily his game. Mm -hmm. All right, are you in the lobby again, happen. by the way? Yeah, I am. I made it in just too late to spectate that last Ah, game. gotcha. All right. So we now have Spiegel as backside of the TV's last hope. Uh, we're going to get him versus Dr. Dre up first. And then if he can beat Dr. Dre, he still has Slappy and Zerky Durky to go through. This is now a 1v3. Yeah, geez, this uh, Wake Up Super is kind of a powerhouse of a team now that I'm looking at the uh, lineup. Yeah. They, uh, they put on a real good showing in both their matches so far. This is their second one. This is only week two of the event. We have ten? Ten and a half, and then finals? So, see if they can keep it up. I would not be surprised, but also see how much everyone else grows during... Oh, yeah. Uh, oh, Spiegel's on a trio, I didn't know that. Yeah, those are fairly rare at the moment. Uh, it sounds like we might actually be getting a couple more as people are picking up additional characters. Good anti here with the Accelabella. Didn't get a pickup off it, and she converted into a nice reset. Wake team up wake super. up super yeah <laughs> man if this is not a team named after Dre, like... <laughs> <laughs> oh man when fighting yeah, Dre, I... the... go ahead oh i was just gonna talk about trios but uh because there's so many there's so many solo players in this um, league i feel like playing a trio you really have to be confident in your uh, control in not getting touched. <laughs> yeah. Because, like, in, in a normal tournament with where it's mostly trios and duos, you know, trios are probably the way to go, but here, uh, there's they so can many. Scary, though, yeah. Yeah, like, I, I've been. Go ahead. Oh, I, uh, I've been learning a. I've been learning a team at the moment, but it's. I feel like any time I play against a solo, I just want to go back to playing a solo. <laughs> just for that matchup specifically. Yeah, that is that is fair. Also, as uh, Fettuccini points out, Dre, I believe, just used DP four times in a row in Ooh. That, Ooh. Okay, that is actually invincible the whole way through. I wasn't expecting that. That was a really, really good choice then to save the assist from the damage. Yeah. Because dang, if that assist, if that super does not do. Yeah, would that have been a dead assist if that super had gone through? I don't think so, but only because she was at full health. It probably would have put her about here. Speaking okay. of which, though, uh, Spiegel has. Yep, yep, not much you can do there. Chip death, there's no real way to prevent that uh, outside of just not having to block in the first place. So there's definitely some supers in this game that are just kind of checkmates. But in a situation like that, even a push block, I'm pretty sure Bayo could have just dashed straight back and hit anyways. No. I yeah. Have to block, I guess. Block. Yeah, if you're blocking, you're losing. Yeah. Called a fighting game, not a blocking game. That's why you just never block. Just take the hit. <laughs> oh. anyway, so this is now potentially the last life for backside of the TV. If they do, like, if Spiegel loses this game, then their team 
has lost this match. If he can bring it back, though, and that match was close enough that I would not be horribly surprised if he did. Uh, and then he gets some more school girls action. Good punish. Ooh, drops the yeah. combo. Ooh. That's a real unfortunate drop. Yeah. Is this, if uh, Spiegel loses here, would this be the first uh, full team sweep of, that we've uh, seen? Or yes, yes, it would. <laughs> what happened there? <laughs> uh, fail band moment. I, I don't know. You know, you know that is that is fair. Well, that was a real good delay on that second dash to make a solid train trap. Ah, uh, blocked the incoming, but was not confident that he'd be able to punish, so he didn't push anything. Actually, got hit himself for it. Oh my god, man. Uh, <laughs> yeah, that, that would have been... I think this is a dead Cerebella. Does that? Oh, but no swap out. All you need is the, the big heavy kick. It seems like uh, Spiegel's doing really well for the most part, but he's getting a couple drops that are looking like they're not reset attempts, and those are costing him big time. Especially against a team like Bayo Band, played by Dre. This is now the last stand for Spiegel. Can he make it out? Is he just going to get run over by this uh, rather unga team, I'd say? <laughs> That was oh. a very brave mash out, but that was real good. <laughs> Whatever, just throw you know, a chip damage at it, it'll go away. Ooh. Oh my. Oh, yeah. Yeah, I guess it wasn't scaled yet, so. Alright, and with oh, yeah. that, we do have Team Wake Up Super taking a very commanding lead, or er, commanding victory. Yeah, jeez. Uh, who? Wait, am I? Is Team Swag fighting Wake Up Soup next week? Uh, here. Let me actually. Is this one? All right. So here is the schedule for next week. We have Team Swag versus Wake Up Super. So yep, that's you guys. Uh, we've got six two three B, who we saw earlier awesome. today at roughly four o'clock against Liquid Meat, who was in the last match. We've got my team, the Gun Show versus Backside of the TV, who here in this one. And the Red, Findi or Red Fighting Mongooses will be playing both the backside of the TV and 623B, as one of those matches got delayed from week one. Yeah, so uh, definitely stay tuned. I believe that's every match that we have for this week, so we will be back next week. Uh, weeks for this are Sunday to Saturday. So there's a decent chance we'll have at least one of these next Sunday. 